Hello everybody, welcome, it's Daniel. Today you're gonna to learn how to build an Android app. So if you've never programmed before, you don't have any experience, maybe you've never programmed, you don't know what code is, but you heard about Android or you wanna just make an Android app, this is the course for you. So we're gonna need a couple of things. Well, actually just one thing. That's pr the primary thing we need is called Android Studio. So just go ahead and Google Android Studio and click on the first result here and it's at developer.android.com slash studio. I'll put the link in the, in the description, but this is the website you need to go to to download Android Studio. Now it's available for Mac, Windows, uh, Mac, Windows, and Linux, so whatever platform you're on, you can download this, and you do need this to build an Android app. There, there are some kind of odd, other, odd ways to do it without Android Studio, but this is what de most developers, 99% of developers probably use this. It has a lot of tools for creating user interfaces. As you can see here, they have uh, something called constraint layout where you can like add images and pictures to your apps. Um, we'll, learn, we'll learn about all this kind of stuff. You don't, need, you don't need to know any of this right now. I'll go through it in this course, but this is kind of what it is. So go ahead into the top here and download Android Studio, and that may take a little bit depending upon how good your internet connection is, but it's important to note that you can't like develop on a tablet or like an iPad or an Android tablet or something. You're gonna need a PC, and the faster, the more memory it has, the more RAM it has, the faster it is, the better. So you can do it with a, a lower, cheaper end computer, but it might not be as fast as something that I have right here or that's something else, uh, you know, with the more beefy system. So go ahead and download this, and it, this, it may take a little bit, like I said earlier, and then I'll catch you in the next video where we will uh, we'll actually get started building an Android app.